Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna share with you my morning routine of a working mama. This is my routine Monday through Friday because I am a full-time working mom. I work at a school that my daughter also attends and I am so excited to show you guys how our mornings go and what I do to prep and share my tips and tricks to make our mornings go as smooth as possible. This video is extra special because it is a collab with my girl. She goes by Dreaming of the Farm. That is her YouTube handle and also her Instagram handle. Her name is Alyssa and she is a mama of two little girls that are two and under. She lives in New Jersey with her little family of four and they just bought a new house so she will also be documenting that journey on her YouTube channel. She is an amazing mama that is completely down to her earth and I love her recipes and just her decor and just day in the life videos that she shares on her channel. She also shared her V back journey which was just 17 months months after having her oldest daughter and she if you mamas if that is your experience experience or you are contemplating having a VBAC go check out her channel and her video if you are over from Alyssa's channel welcome hi my name is dream I am a mama of two I have a 17 year old son who just started 12th grade I can't believe it and I have a three-year-old daughter and she is in preschool I share a lot of home decor videos on my channel, cleaning videos, I do grocery haul, just that kind of mom content. I love sharing my tips and tricks. I've been a mom for quite a while, so I love sharing all my tips and tricks with you guys. Um, the first few clips that I was talking through, you guys saw that I wake up every morning and I make my bed. My husband commutes an hour to go to work. We are Southern California people. Um, so he uh, gets up way earlier than I do. If you look in the mirror, the window, you can see that he was watching TV. He watches ESPN every morning, so he's already downstairs. I changed my um, bottoms, and I am heading off into our garage to work out, and I work out Monday through Fridays. I try to work out between 30, 30 35 minutes um, each day. On the weekends, it's my day off. This day I was doing a 15 a meter row and I try to do that as quick as possible. And then I also was doing 100 sit-ups. So this day I did not do any weights, but I also incorporate weights and that kind of stuff into my workout as well. For me, what has worked for me is waking up an hour before my kids. This way I get to get my workout in and eat my breakfast and watch the news and just gear up for our day. Um, I am a person, I work nine hours a day. I am not, when I get home, I, my energy is gonna be low. I'm not gonna wanna work out. For, so for me, I'm a morning person. Working out in the morning just works for me. But you decide what works for you. Maybe you are a night owl, so working out at night will work for you. But this works out for me, and I get to start my morning off in silence for just a little bit. My oldest, he sets his own alarm and everything, and he doesn't wake up until 6 o'clock. Um, we started this when he was in eighth grade. Um, we trained him to get up with his alarm and take his shower and to get ready. Um, this is just something that he's used to doing and he rarely ever sleeps through his alarm. His alarm is not right next to his bed. It is away from his bed so he actually has to get up to cut it off. And that's another trick that I do. So if you have older children, it is great to start training them and getting them ready with an alarm so they can wake themselves up and jump into the shower where you can still do your thing. So after I take a quick shower, I probably wash my hair every 10 days, so that is not something that I have to do in the morning. Um, this week was like our spirit week, so we got to wear jeans all week long. So this day was leopard print day. I didn't have a ton of leopard print, but I'm wearing leopard print shoes, and I have a leopard print mask, and then Brooklyn will have her leopard print shoes and hair bows in as well. So um, yeah, this week was a fun week because I actually got to wear jeans to work all week long but I am just doing my hair really quick. I am not a big beauty guru girl at all. Um, I put on mascara every day. I um, maybe put a little um, 
I don't powder to not powder but um, eyeshadow in the corners of my eyes to brighten them up a bit but I'm not good with makeup I don't do a lot of makeup I don't put any foundation or anything like that on and um, my getting ready routine is pretty quick it takes me about 15 20 minutes is already up he knows that he needs to wake up and make his bed this is a day that I actually have a YouTube video going live so there's a few things that I do I usually put out something on my Instagram to say that my YouTube video is going live and then right here I'm just checking my thumbnail not my thumbnail I'm checking my description to make sure I linked and had everything that needed to be there and then I'm showing you that my son got up he made his bed he already showered and he is actually downstairs and he breakfast and I am now going to wake up my littlest. I did not put the camera on her because who wants the camera on you while you just woke up? She did was like why was the camera in my room? Which was funny but I am. I cut off her sound machines. I cut off her lights and all of that stuff. I let some light in and then I let her kind of wake up slowly. We make her bed really quickly. Her clothes, another tip is we pick out her clothes the night before. Probably when she got two and a half, she got really particular about what she was wearing. So we pick them out the night before. She hangs them on this hook the night before. Everything, underwear, socks, everything she picks out the night before. So that is easy breezy. So while I am getting her milk ready, she requested to have cereal this morning. My son actually had a bagel. Um, she is going potty and sitting down and watching TV. She is obsessed with Paw Patrol, so that is on heavy rotation at our house currently. Um, everything we bring downstairs. So she gets ready downstairs and you will see that. So we bring out her clothes downstairs, all of her toothbrush, hair supplies, everything I keep in the downstairs bathroom. So I'm setting up her toothbrush, I am getting out her hair stuff so that as soon as she's done and finished eating breakfast and getting herself dressed, I can just jump right into that. And then I'm straightening up the pillows downstairs. While she is eating, I go and I, another tip is I make all of our breakfasts, not breakfast, I make our lunches the night before. My son, he is doing online schooling, so he has leftovers typically that he'll heat up um, for his lunch but um, me and my daughter I make our to-go lunches the night before my husband also makes his lunch the night before as well I'm showing you guys our mask we have to wear a mask all day at our jobs uh, she has to wear a mask there are certain times throughout the day she doesn't have to wear a mask but for the most part at school she has to wear a mask the cupboards are open behind us because my son when he is done eating breakfast he has to put away all of the dishes um, and then I am setting as much as I can into the car. My daughter likes to bring in her own backpack and her own lunchbox. But all my stuff I set in the car so I don't have to worry about that when we are heading out the door. So at this point, my daughter is actually done eating breakfast, so I'm going to clean up all of that stuff. You can see the dishes have miraculously gone away because my son put those up. Pick, put those away. But um, she is getting dressed. She gets dressed by herself. So I am just tidying up the house and just making sure that everything is in place for the day. Now she is done getting herself ready and I will do her hair. So I just use two products and uh, she has curly hair as you can see, but the golden goose is a wet brush and a good detangler. So I can get all the tangles out of her curls. And then this day she requested to have pigtails. So pigtails I do. I usually ask her what she, how she wants me to do her hair. 
It's usually a ponytail, but this day we switched it up just a bit and she did pink tails. all of her stuff sitting out. That is another one of my tips. I tips, I do double duty. So while she is doing one thing, I am doing something else just to prep and to get us ready for the next task. Um, I just think that works much easier and anything that you can prep the night before, please do it, please do it. And Paw Patrol is our little savior because she will sit still while I do her hair while she is watching. You can see I have it set out as well. We do lotion, we do sunscreen, I'm putting everything back, and then we will, I will let her brush her teeth while I am doing her sunscreen, and then we will give brother a hug and then head out the door. I hope you guys thoroughly enjoy this um, routine, and please don't forget to go check out my girl, Dreaming of the Farm. I will have all her information linked down below in my description box. Follow her on Instagram and check out her video after this one and see how she juggles her mornings with her little two little girls, two and under. guys I'm going to end the video here Brooklyn say bye bye we are in the parking lot of our school um, I work at the school I don't know if I said that earlier and Brooklyn goes to the school that I work at so my glasses are crooked but I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video I hope you enjoyed watching um, morning routine of a working mom and you got some tips and tricks to make your morning just that much easier but we are all in this together and we all just try our best and that's all you can do but thank you guys for watching don't forget to give the video a thumbs up and we will see you in the next one bye